Well, it's day uh, 34 at the Cooper Hawk Nest. And this is our female. She's up in the tree. She's having a misty day. It's keeping her wet. And she's guarding the youngsters, so... They're up in the tree over in the nest. In the nest tree. And I came over on the other side and I found her in one of her favorite perches she used the last uh, couple of years. So here she is in her favorite tree of course you can see the nest and see the youngsters and she's more or less guarding them keeping an eye on them until the male shows up with breakfast so. and when he comes in with the breakfast she'll uh, go receive it from him get it prepared and then uh, fly into the nest and they'll all pile in there and we'll have a feeding so but it's day 34 for our cooper hawks our youngsters, and this is, I believe, the female, yep. Here she is on guard, like I said, and this is one of her favorite perches. And this is right across from uh, the nest they used the last two years, so. And they're only like, the new nest is only like 50 yards from the old nest anyway, so. Still the same territory. But there she is, she's on guard. Keeping an eye on the youngsters, and he's got to watch uh, all the ducks and herons and everything that come in. There's a lot of activity here. She pitched onto a blue heron a day or so ago. Got too close to the nest tree when it flew by, and I didn't think she would go after a heron, but she run right down into the swamp. So you don't mess with mama and her babies, I'll tell you that. She's very aggressive. And she did a good job. That heron couldn't get down in the swamp quick enough because she spiraled right after him. Now she's looking. Let's see if she uh, may have heard something from the male. Going to stretch and relieve herself and off she goes. All right, we'll go over to the nest then. 